Hey guys, I'm back and I'm back with some more animation throwdown and it has been a while. Yes, I know it has been a while and a lot of you guys are probably wondering where the heck have you been? Yeah, what happened? Yeah, you've been MIA for almost a week or maybe over a week. I, I think it was over a week now. Um, yeah, I, I was busy. I'm very busy. Uh, it, those that do have a, a job, uh, yeah, you get with with more responsibility uh, comes with more hours. Uh, more hours means less free time, and the uh, the amount of free time that I do have, uh, yeah, gets allotted uh, to my family, to my kids, uh, because yeah, when it comes to uh, choosing free time to play games or make uploads and or spending time with my kids. Uh, yeah, sorry, you guys are gonna lose all the time. Yeah, it's, it's, I'd rather spend time with them. Uh, that's not to say I, I still appreciate you guys. I still, <laughs> I still, yeah, I still think highly of you guys. It's just, yeah, I, I just they they have a higher priority, and uh, that's the main reason why. I just been very busy, even in the weekends. Uh, though it does mean more money's coming in. Just. <laughs> I guess I'm lucky I'm not spending it on this game and now uh, yeah we're gonna do a lot of talking a lot of talking a lot of random talk about this game because there have been a lot of updates a lot of updates and new things that have, uh, that have popped up in this game and uh, yeah I'm pretty sure yeah last week yeah it was last week when that new uh, buff update made its appearance and you guys were probably wondering what my opinions are and now I'm gonna give you guys my thoughts and opinions of that buff yeah, that steroids buff that legendaries uh, end up getting in Mythics. Uh, but yeah, that's just going to be part of this random talk. Uh, yeah, I, I'm trying to figure out where I should start because I missed, yeah, I missed uh, a lot of, uh, yeah, a lot of things. Uh, well, I don't want to say I missed. Yeah, I, I still play daily. <laughs> just I haven't, I've missed. A lot of opportunities to create uploads uh, to talk about new things that pop up in this game uh, so I, I guess I will I'll start off with this screen uh, right here uh, we'll talk about some bundles uh, as you guys know the mythic bundle uh, is ending soon uh, I already did my purchase as you can tell the top corner I, I do have my gems I did purchase those uh, mythic bundles because uh, mythics are the the rave right now everybody's trying to get their mythic cards uh, and rightfully so the mythic cards are very very powerful right now especially the combinations you can create with them uh, but yeah if you guys haven't and you guys still after that mythic card or want to upgrade your mythic card definitely take advantage of that uh, that deal even so you may not want to buy any boxes right now you know just set that gems aside for other stuff that do pop up in this game uh, and then uh, this thing popped up today giggity watts bundle I know a lot of people have been waiting for that 100 for 100 you know the 100 gems for 100 watts uh, it's been a while maybe a month since that that deal made an appearance the last time it showed up uh, but they did show up with this giggity watts bundle uh includes five uh five adventure energies you know the 10 plus two arena energies the 10 plus ones and then you get 1500 giggity watts and then 1500 gems limit four and uh, the price tag on this thing is uh basically 25 us dollars now I know some will look at this and go, meh, yeah, what a ripoff, you know, what a bad deal. Uh, but you have to, I, I guess if you do your calculations right, you'll actually find out that uh, this is a better deal than that 100 for 100. And uh, I, guess, I guess I'll explain to you guys, you know, how I see it as far as this deal goes. Now, when we do that 100 for 100, a lot of people do buy, max it out. They buy the limit, which is 4K. Now, in order to, I, I guess, to have the right amount of gems to do that 4K, uh, purchase that 4K watts, you need to uh, buy at least $50 worth of uh, gems, which equals 4,500, 4,500 gems. 
uh, once you get your 40k, and that's the limit. Once you hit that 40k gigawatts, I mean not 40k, 4k. <laughs> yeah, 40k. That's pretty outrageous. But 4k watts, uh, it disappears, and then it's over, and then you're left with about 500 gems. Now you can use those. 500 gems on whatever you want you can use it to uh more watts you know use it for the upgrades and that will cut it in half because it takes two gems per one giggity watt so you you'll roughly i guess total if you use that 4500 that 4500 all for upgrading for the watts you'll basically have 4250 watts total and then and again that deal's over once you get that 4k watts the deal is over now let's take a look at this and now i'll explain why this is so much better than that now of course if you're gonna you know spend 50 dollars us dollars just like you would if the 100 for 100 was available you'd purchase this twice if you purchase this twice that'll give you about 3,000 gems get about 3,000 giggity watts and then you'll get two you know actually four of the arena refills and then 10 of the world energy uh, the adventure mode uh, refills now let's disregard the refills that's just a bonus that's something you're getting extra let's concentrate on the watts so you got 3,000 watts now as and you have 3,000 gems now, if you decided to use that 3,000 gems for upgrading, let's say you decided, you know what, I'm just going to use that gems for to upgrade, that will pretty much be, uh, you'll pretty much be able to upgrade it up to uh, 1,500 watts. Because again, you know, two gems equals one giggity watt. So that's 1,500. You add that to the 3,000, that's 4,500. So with that $50, you actually ended up getting an extra 250 watts. Yeah, a total of 4,500 watts in total. And don't forget, you had that bonus, you know, refills that came along with that. So again, with $50, with the 100, with uh, 100 for 100, you get a total of 4,250 watts total with that with that amount of gems that you get that 4,500 gems this on the other hand you will receive if you use it all for watts 4,500 an additional 250 watts but you also because it's up to you whether you want to use that 3,000 on gem, you know on the watts on upgrading you have that option of whether to hold on to that 3 k gems and just use it for box opens but again if you were strictly going for watts you definitely in upgrading you definitely would do better spending 50 dollars on this now another thing that makes this even better is the fact that i know a lot of times when people do that 100 for 100 they wish they could get more they wish they could keep purchasing more watts well because this is a limit for you actually can do it again you know spend another 50 and go through the same process so in the total amount of watts you will get if you decided to just use all the gems and all the watts you know everything for upgrading is a total of you know uh I believe 9000 9000 watts to play around with upgrading your cards you don't get that with 100 for 100 again once the four you get your 4000 k uh 4000 you know uh giggity watts once you purchase that limit it's over it's gone that deal's gone this one will allow you to yeah almost like purchasing it twice but again you get an additional two five, up to 500 extra bonus watts on top of that you get all the refills now that that's my uh, i guess that's uh my explanation why i think this giggity watts bundle is very very good right now and if those that are desperate to upgrade your legendaries yeah because a lot of people are <laughs> they need to level up their legendaries this is a perfect you know deal right now and uh don't wait for that 100 for 100 go for this because it's basically the same but even better so all right 
so we uh, talked about that. Yeah, we were almost 10 minutes just talking about that. Uh, let's talk about some of these boxes. You know, let's talk about some of these boxes, like this one. Uh, hmm. Yeah, let's talk about this. And this is the first of the disguise box sets. Uh, I won't take long talking about it because uh, because of the buffs uh, that up the buff update uh, it really changed a lot of things it, uh, changed the way I view boxes now uh, before I view a box I take a look at the pre combos take a look at the pre combos you know legendaries and the two epics and then I'll deter you know I usually determine whether or not to go for it but because of the update that what that happened last week now you have to look at the first six cards because there's 12 cards in this box six legendaries and then six epics what used to be the terrible four are now the terrible six yeah epics yeah they really got they got screwed yeah they turned to crap overnight uh and this one right here which would have been a nice card is no longer a nice card uh even this uh well disco hank was not good in the first place but yeah the the epic pre combos are now irrelevant yeah they don't fit in this meta that kong is trying to go towards uh or the the i, I guess the direction they're trying to move forward to and uh, the only thing that are worth getting now are the legendaries especially this one this is just an item item card but because of the buffs because of the I, I guess the new meta you take a look at it you take a look at his skill set you take a look at this this skills if uh, this card would have popped up maybe two months ago you would have said this is probably one of the best you know pre combos around but it's not a pre combo it is just an item card and this is what to expect moving forward from legendary item cards and character cards also and this box does include, you know, a three, you know, disguised, disguised cards, uh, legendaries, which is pretty awesome. And of course, good old Hank Hill, he's here, he's back. Yeah, he's back. And uh, then you got Linda Belcher. All right. So you got those two characters. Uh, not too fond of uh, these two characters, though Hank Hill does create Devil Hank, which is going to be very uh, useful during this BG. Uh, but I'm pretty sure because of how many times Hank Hill has showed up in boxes. I mean, you guys probably have enough to quad fuse 20 of them. <laughs> I know I, if I would have saved him, uh, yeah, I'd have about enough to quad fuse 20 of them. Uh, but as far as the pre combo goes, uh, that's another thing that's changed uh, as my views on pre combos, even the legendaries. Uh, because now, because. Because of the way the buff is and the way combos now have such great, you know, uh, skill points and stats, uh, pre combos now have taken the back seat. Uh, yeah, they sh they sit shotgun now to the you know to the drivers, the combinations, and uh, if you compare the skill set points and the stats to one that when you create the combo it's almost twice uh it's very noticeable uh the difference so uh that kind of that kind of takes away uh a lot of things from uh, legendary pre-combos you really have it really has to be a legendary pre-combo that just has some outstanding skill sets and uh, outstanding uh stats uh this one only thing kind of outstanding on this card uh i'd say is maybe gas 14 and it's hp at 54 other than that uh not that special and then the heal also is unfortunately only a bob's burger heal uh so this one is not that great uh box in general is not that great though which costume is pretty awesome right now and uh this one is definitely very awesome uh Again, you'll be doing opens for six, trying to get six of these cards uh, and have a high rate of getting terrible six. <laughs> yeah, these six craps, uh, piece of crap uh, cards. Uh, and I'm not calling them piece of crap. Uh, a week ago or two weeks ago, I wouldn't have called these piece of, piece of craps. Uh, basically, Kong's the one calling them piece of craps. Uh, yeah, because they didn't do nothing to... Uh, 
yeah nothing as far as the updates on epics uh so the next card uh, or box that the repeat box that showed up monday was sandwich box again you know it's different the way you look at boxes now because you can't take a these six four I mean these uh six epic cards you basically just ignore them now you don't even take a look at them you hope and pray you don't get them during your opens and you hope that you end up getting plenty of these legendaries of course those with experience with opens know that these love to show up more often more often than these cards uh but as far as whether this box is worth it uh, that depends on the person. Uh, if they were really after this sandwich, always wanted this card, which is a pretty awesome card, uh, especially during this BG. Uh, though, you take a look at the skill sets. Again, this is an old card, so it does not match the meta at all. Though it did get some, I, I guess, minor buffs. I, I believe it was only 25% for uh, legendary pre-combos. Really, the compared to that new item card, uh, that costume card, uh, Escra Esquesnot, uh, <laughs> I'm having a hard time pronouncing it. Uh, this card right here, Esquanot, uh, costume, yeah, sandwich doesn't seem that great, uh, but again, it's a pre combo, so uh, all right, uh. I think it's a it's an okay card. Uh, this box does have uh, books of spells, which is a great uh, item card. Uh, stats are pretty good, uh, though it does have that boost. Uh, then we got Chris Griffin, not that great of a card, but again, take a look at his uh, his stats and his skill sets. Not too bad, not too shabby. And then we uh, take a look at Scary Mask, and he is very scary because he has that 8888, which used to be, uh, yeah, well, Wingnut Leela had 8888, and uh, now Scary Mask has that. On, on top of that, has that high 54 HP. Uh, very good, very good item card. Um, the other two legendaries are uh, Personalized Beer Mug. It's a drunk card, uh, but it's okay. An okay card. Uh, it does have that 8 Motivate, which is universal, but it only has Bomb 4. But again, you take a look at his stats. 14 Attack is pretty excellent uh, for an item card. And then that high 44 HP. Pretty awesome. And then Tina. Yes, Tina, I think is an awesome card again. Uh, Stats were boosted on this card. Uh, has that leech 11. Pretty cool. Uh, and yeah, as you notice, nah, well, I'm pretty sure you guys noticed. They got these new icons, which I'm not a fan of. Uh, that leech, I, I like the way it looked before with the vi vampire icon. Some of the icons I do like. Some of the new, some of them I dislike. Uh, like craze i don't like evil monkey i, I like that uh, that hockey mask that hockey mask look crazy that uh evil monkey just looks like a pissed off monkey uh doesn't doesn't uh yeah doesn't bring out that that feeling of craze as uh that that jason hockey mask does uh but yeah these are these two boxes um as you can tell, uh, I didn't do any opens, they didn't do the specials, uh, don't want to do the specials. Uh, I, I think ever since that buff uh, made its appearance, I'm kind of uh, hesitating as far as purchasing boxes right now. Uh, yeah, they... I wasn't really happy of... Uh, well, I was... I was happy... I was, I like it and I dislike it. And uh, again, I'm gonna talk about it, but I won't talk about it now. Uh, but as far as doing box opens, I'm very, very hesitant to do them. Uh, I, of course, it's up to the indi individual. Uh, if you guys still think boxes are worth it, go for it. Uh, me, on the other hand, I'm still, I'm still waiting to see the final, final changes uh, of this meta, this meta that. Kong is trying to get to, uh, you know, because it, they're, they're trying to match the meta, they're trying to create balance, they're trying to bring some stuff back into the game, they're making huge changes, and uh, who knows whether or not they're finished, who knows whether or not they're done, you can't really say that they're done doing buffs, because 
just a month ago or so uh they buffed up mythics and then all of a sudden they decided they needed more buffs uh as far as epic cards go whether or not they decide that's it epics are no good uh we're not gonna i guess we're not gonna buff them up we're just gonna leave them as is that will definitely uh keep me from wanting to invest anymore in the invest too much into this game uh as far as boxes go uh again i'm right now i'm just i'm just uh, I, I don't think it's a good deal any boxes right now um uh, Again, you know, who knows? Maybe Thursday's box may be uh, pretty awesome, and I might, I might end up going for it. I'm not sure. If anything, I know I want to get some of the new item cards more than I want the pre combos. The pre combos, eh, who cares about the pre combos now? Yeah, it, it is. That's crazy. Yeah, that's coming from a guy that usually run, that used to run a full deck, you know, pre combo card deck. It just because of the the new changes in this game. Yeah, running a uh, full PC, you know, uh, pre-combos, power cards, yeah, it's not a good thing. Yes, yeah, it's, it's not smart. Anyways, not right now. Uh, yeah, jeez, uh, I'm going in circles as far as talking. Uh, all right, let's, uh, actually, let's go and collect some stuff, and then uh, we'll talk about more things that has popped up in this game. Yeah. Yeah, this was from the Cycle Brawl. Alright, collected that and let's get rid of it. And then Golden Pack, yeah, from uh, DevBot. Uh, they're giving everybody, giving everybody uh, this Golden Pack uh, free 250, 2500, I mean, 2500 uh, of these uh, Golden Turds. This is a new currency for these new packs. And let's go ahead and claim that. Alright, cool. And uh, yeah, it says go. No, we'll go later. Uh, let's go later. And uh, all right, I don't know why this didn't uh, change. Yeah, this is, it says zero. Yeah, it says zero. But I actually do have uh, 2,500. And it takes 1,000 to do these opens. Uh, yeah, let's take a look. Where, where the heck is Ricky Spanish? Yeah, where the heck is that guy? Yeah, new hero. Yeah, Ricky Spanish. And uh, okay maxed out pretty cool uh has that new new skill uh give uh and then it has heal three shield three and okay uh i guess the awesome thing about this card is it's it's ricky spanish <laughs> but other than that uh, not, not a fan of the skill sets that hero comes with uh but uh let's see what are we gonna yeah let's talk about Actually, let's talk about adventure mode. Let's talk about adventure mode before we go into that golden turd, uh, golden turd thing. Cause I, I will do the opens in front of you guys. Okay, it updated. Now it's showing two thousand five hundred in the top corner. Yeah, let's talk about adventure mode. Uh, let's talk about this stuff right here. And the, uh, we did get new, you know, stages or chapters. I haven't unlocked them yet. I'm still going in the process of uh, going going through and collecting uh, it takes a lot of uh adventure mode energy uh going through a lot of refills doing this uh but yeah, let's take a look at this uh as you can take a as you can see you are no longer able to farm cards uh they took that away uh each time you complete like bronze you'll get three of these uh hank hank's hell haunted house and then uh you unlock silver, you'll get million dollar beer can. Uh, gold, you'll get Bob's Burgers, get one of those. And then you'll get a second one uh, if you unlock the Onyx uh, level. And once you unlock all of them, uh, you'll get a chance uh, of these two. Uh, golden Turds or Giggity Watts. Uh, or maybe both, I haven't done it yet. Uh, what do I think of this? Uh, well, from what I've seen so far from screenshots uh, of people that did receive them, it's a very low amount. Uh, not that much. Giggity Watts wise, not a lot. Uh, Golden Turd wise, uh, not a lot either. Uh, I've seen like seven, I've seen eight, uh, some five. Uh, I haven't seen anyone receive more than 10 yet. 
uh, and I think that's very that sucks. I really do. Uh, I I'm not liking that at all. Uh, when I do my when because I know when I farm, I'm after those uh, you know the epic Gigi Watts cards, uh, the rare Gigi Watts cards. You know the epic gives 50 watts. The green, uh, the rare Gigi Watts gives 25. And if I get some epics, they give 25 Gigi Watts. The fact that I may get a chance of getting seven, maybe get a chance of five, and that's, you know, if you get a chance to, because it won't drop all the time. You have to be lucky in order to get them. That sucks. Yeah, it, it, it really lowered your your chances of getting giggity watts that you need daily. Uh, and I don't know, I don't, I, I don't see any player that's going to be happy with that simply due to the fact that now legendaries are the thing it's going to take a lot of giggity watts to level them up and this is going to make it make it i, I guess you're going to struggle because of this uh that's just how i view it uh it's i i don't even even this i don't like the fact that you're limited to only one uh get it only getting it once and then that's it you have to rely on the rng of the super epic packs you gotta rely on the rng of the golden turd if you're even lucky enough to accumulate them enough to even do an open you have to rely on rng you can't if you want a Peggy, you can't just go to 5-3 anymore or 5-1. Uh, you have to... Yeah, you have... To, uh, actually, I, I don't know how the heck you're going to get your epics. But then again, epics are irrelevant, as I mentioned before. Uh, they no, no longer hold that much value uh, because of the new buffs. Uh, so that that almost makes me question... If, if Kong is trying to say that legendaries are now, you know, I, I guess the epics, because before epics were all you needed to be competitive, you know, uh, epics and some legendaries, of course, you know, the guys that buy the boxes, that's a totally different level, but mostly free to play in order for them to be competitive, they had to farm these epics, but epics are now yeah they're not as good as they were before and legendaries are now what you need to have in order to be competitive so where are the legendaries here that's a that's the some that's something i gotta ask you know if uh this is what the new standard is if legendaries are the new standard uh they are what you that's required to be able to compete in uh secret fight club in rumble and uh in cycle brawl events in challenges then where are they? I, I don't see any. I'm, I'm taking a look at every one of these things. And all I do is see epics, rares, and uh, common cards. And again, Kong has, because of the update, they have told everyone, the whole community, epics, rares, and commons are no longer valid. They, they don't, they're obsolete. They, they hold no value. They You will not be able to compete in this new meta that we're moving forward to. Yet, when it comes to these adventure modes, unlocking, even finishing in the, the highest in the past the 20s, I don't see a single legendary here. Not a single legendary card. And I think that's crap. Yeah, I think that's messed up, and I, I think it's kind of, yeah, I, I think if they want to move to legendaries only, if they want everything to be legendaries only, why, why, why aren't you giving away the legendaries? Uh, and if this is the only, if this is their way of saying, well, you'll get their legendaries here. Yeah, okay. Yeah, you don't even know what you're going to get with this. Look at how many legendaries are in here. You, you, you're you gonna have to rely on pure randomness and chances of getting four of a kind of any of these you know without taking a lot of time you know time and patience maybe <laughs> maybe you're lu you'll be lucky in six months or maybe close to a year before you get four of a kind of anything here yeah you gotta it's gonna require a lot of luck yeah if that if that's what the, uh, Kong is saying 
that you have to do then that sucks that just straight up sucks uh, yeah I think that's an awful uh, that's pretty awful um, but yeah that was the adventure mode the new update I'm not a fan of it I don't think it's farming is gonna be again it's gonna be a pain to farm watts now you're gonna have to rely on doing your pack openings uh, more to get giggity watts than you are just farming getting some you know let epic giggity watts or epic cards to just recycle uh, yeah that sucks and now let's talk about this the golden turd uh, the golden pack now I, I guess the special thing about this uh, this these packs they go with uh, whatever is uh, the current BG the new BG obviously there are no athletics even so athletic cards are athletic BG is still going on uh, it's all disguise it's gonna go with what the new current one is and the cool thing about this you no longer have to guess what pre combos are coming up in the future you know in the future in the upcoming weeks uh, this box will show all the pre combos like this one honey mustache Stewie uh, this one right here mission control Chris cool and then uh, this one also spray on army fry so that's pretty awesome and not only that if you do if you're luck you are lucky enough to collect uh, enough to do an open you will uh, get cards only that only uh, I guess pertain to the BG that's going on uh, so that's pretty awesome uh, but again look at how many cards are in here and uh, try to guess what your chances are of getting four of a kind uh, maybe you'll get uh, you know a single fuse you'll get two if you're lucky uh, but getting four in the, the amount of golden turds uh, it takes to uh, do an open and the, I guess the drop rate of how many how much you earn daily uh, yeah it's it's gonna take quite a while who knows but maybe by the time you get four of a kind of uh, <laughs> one of these if you're lucky get four of a kind BG will be over and you you're you won't even be able to use it uh, but yeah that's that's this and uh, we're actually gonna go ahead and uh, we'll do our two opens and uh, let's see what we end up getting on this let's uh go do our first one and let's uh yeah let's go see what we end up getting and who would have guessed i got trolled by you get the heck out of here pimperu yeah this is my first open of the golden turd and i definitely definitely got a turd <laughs> a turd named pimperu and uh let's do our second one and uh let's hope for not no no so pimperu no bob jean wow this really is a bad sign uh of what to expect from this golden turd that was pretty horrific bob jean and pimperu out of all this yeah they they show all this all this nice stuff right here all these nice things right here but i end up getting this pimperu and uh bob jean where the heck is bob jean <laughs> oh right here bob jean is right here hiding hiding but yeah it is what it is and that's uh that's my golden turd opens and uh <laughs> all right and you know what i'm going to actually uh i'm gonna do some uh some of the super epic packs i'm gonna do that for you guys and we we are past the 30 mark 30 minute mark but i, I hope you guys are still hanging out and watching this because uh, i haven't done an upload in a while so that's probably the main reason why this is going to be a long one but yeah let's let's do some super epic packs uh opens i'm actually gonna do t 10 of them but i won't do this super epic pack times 10 uh and get that extra free one i'm actually gonna do some singles uh i want to try my luck on that and the reason why is because uh earlier last week you know i was going through i was doing like one or two pulls you know here and there and i was able to get you know get a, a mythic mythic stones from it so uh i definitely want to try my luck uh don't want to do this don't want to go for these anything in these boxes so i'm gonna try my luck on that and um 
I don't mind using, you know, uh, I, I, I guess 2,500 gems to do so. Uh, so let's go ahead and try that. We're going to go and do 10. Uh, we'll count it down. Count it with me. All right, let's go with uh, one. See what we get. Ah, no gems. Really hoping for those gems. So this is going to be number two. All right, let's see what we get. Come on, gems. No, no stones, I mean. Yeah, no stones. So that's our, that's two opens so far. So let's go with another one. This is number three. Stones, give me stones. No, no stones. They said no. Here, have dress rehearsal. <laughs> have yourself a dress rehearsal. This is number four now. And we got lowest piano. So far, yeah, not, not so great so far. That was number four. So this is gonna be number five. Let's see what we end up getting here. And still no stones, but we got Lady Wrestling. Yeah, Lady Wrestling. So sick and tired of this card. So that was number five. So we got five more opens to go. This is number six right here. And Dojo Biden. Oh. Why am I getting terrible force? Why am I getting a terrible force? Why are you giving me that? Yeah, give me something at least uh, better than this. Give me a legendary at least. So uh, that was number six. So we have four more. Let's do four more. And another lady wrestling. Oof. So we got three more to go. Yeah, let's go ahead and... Yeah, let's just keep trying. You got... And Dale and a Luis. Oof. So two more. Yeah, let's go ahead and try two more. And restaurant and Rogers Place and Bob. Not a single Giggity Watts. Done. I was hoping for at least a Giggity Watts card. And so our last and final one. And Gamer, Klaus, and Alamo Beer. And that was, yeah, that was about, that was 50, 25, yeah, 2,500, I mean. So, yeah, no luck on that. Mm, again, but then not, not so lucky on opens. But we we will have some Giggity Watts at least from those things. Uh, so let's go ahead and do this. Yeah, we're going to go and do our Mythics. Uh, but let's start with a Power Stone. Let's see what we get so we can recycle this. And we got a Baseball Bobby that will become 25 uh, Giggity Watts. Let's go ahead and open the Epic Stones. And another Alamo beer. Oh wow, they're killing me with this Alamo beer. And then let's go and do our mythics. And as you can tell, I'm close to doing another one because uh, I'm at that 838. Uh, but we have enough to do one open and let's go see what we get. Uh, actually, I don't care what we get. Uh, right now I got all of them unlocked and we did get Stan. So that's pretty cool. I think I could bring them up to six now. So that's pretty awesome. And I'll just, uh, yeah, I'm gonna just wait slowly until I get enough to do my next open on that. Uh, okay, I'll, I'll level them up for you guys right now. Yeah, let's go ahead and uh, take a look at them. Alright. Yeah, we're able to bring them up to six. Uh, next one, we'll be able to bring them up to seven, which uh, will bring up his HP. So uh, right now, not too bad. You know, 12, sturdy, six bomb, and six, uh, six uh, craze, or evil monkey. You <laughs> call it evil monkey. I think the only one that I haven't been, that hasn't leveled up yet or haven't upgraded is Leela. So I'm kind of hoping for Leela, but oh well. Uh, but these are my mythics right now and you know what maybe I should do one match with you guys uh, yeah before so I could end it let's end it with a match uh, let me uh, yeah we'll go against this guy which I'm kind of afraid of going against yeah this guy is pretty tough uh, but we'll do it anyways let's go see how we do going against him and uh, 
yeah, let you guys see some of the crazy combos that can be created right now. And let's turn off auto battle. Uh, yeah, I usually have auto battle running. And so, who are we gonna throw down first? Hmm, let's go ahead and throw Buff Fry down. And then let's go and put uh, Wingnut Leela. Alright, and then let's go and uh, put Leela down. And so next we will uh hmm. let's put down yeah no let's put down time for hard liquor. Some crazy effects right there, huh? Ah, let's create this wingnut lila. Alright. Yeah, we got 14 there. Not too bad. Maybe I should show you guys one more. Uh, yeah, I didn't get to create that many combos there. Uh, but yeah, let's go ahead and do one more. Of course, again, yeah, who knows? Uh, it's been pretty tough. Yeah, Sneaker Fight Club has been very, very difficult lately. But yeah, let's go ahead and do this. And they got Witch Costume ready to go. All right. Uh, whew. What are we going to do here? Let's... Uh, hmm. Let's put badminton uh, down. Please, no. Oh. <laughs> yeah, I, I, I thought they were going to put Hank. Yeah, I really thought they were going to put Hank in the... I don't know whether or not they create... You can create Devil Hank with those two. But let's put down Leela. Then let's actually create, yeah, Bucking Bugaloo Leela. Then let's motivate, yeah, let's motivate that Buckling Bugaloo Leela. Then let's motivate that heavy metal Haley. Let's put down another one. Alright, we end up winning again there. Though it's just practice. But yeah, well, this is going on a 45 minute, very long upload. Uh, but yeah, let me end this now. Uh, so uh, yeah. To my subscribers, old, new, and current, yeah, I appreciate you guys. Thanks for the views, and uh, yeah, I apologize again for uh, taking such a long break uh, from doing an upload for you guys again. Yeah, my free time is uh, very limited, and that's the only reason why. Uh, I did have one uh, subscriber, uh, Nine Inch Nails THX uh, 007, uh, did leave a, a very nice comment uh, for me. So yeah, yeah, I appreciate it, bro. Thanks for the kind words. Uh, and yeah, I will uh, catch you guys again in my next upload. Hopefully not too long. Uh, but yeah, that's all I got for now. Bye.